Hi there! After this lesson, you should be able to determine whether the decimal form of a rational number is repeating or terminating. Let's start by defining rational number. A rational number is simply a number that can be written as a fraction. You can see the word ratio, or the comparison of two integers, such as in a fraction, in the word rational. Rational numbers include decimals, mixed numbers, percents, and other fractions. Which of the following are rational numbers? All of these numbers are rational because they can all be written as a fraction. Oftentimes, we like to write these fractions in simplest form. In other words, we divide the numerator and the denominator by the greatest common factor. This gives us the smallest number possible in both the numerator and denominator. If you have an improper fraction, you will also want to write it as a mixed number. Every rational number written as a fraction can also be written in decimal form by dividing the numerator and the denominator. 1 divided by 4 equals 25 hundredths. For rational numbers, each decimal will either be a repeating decimal or a terminating decimal. If a decimal is repeating, the digits to the right of the decimal will eventually repeat. In this instance, we see that 7 and 4 repeat. We can save time when writing this number by drawing a line called the vinculum above the first set of repeating digits. And, just like an exterminator will end your bug problem, a terminating decimal will end at some point. Can you identify whether each decimal is repeating or terminating? These numbers are repeating since they have digits that continuously repeat. The three dots let us know that numbers continue on, and the vinculum over the 2, 6, and 5 tell us that it is repeating. These numbers end, so we call them terminating decimals. Thank you.